All right, first pie guy here. I got the uh, Atomic Pie here with the uh, breakout board connected. And I have my Ethernet, USB mouse and keyboard, and my monitor hooked up there with the uh, HDMI. And I have a 64-bit operating system on the uh, USB here. So we're going to go ahead and plug this in. And I'm just going to show you how to get into the BIOS to boot from the USB on this. So I got my monitor here set up. So let's go ahead and we'll plug this guy in. So as soon as this comes up, we're going to hit delete. So we can get into the setup. So now that we're in the setup, if we scroll over here using our arrow keys, we need to go to boot. And down here, if you use the down and up and down arrow, you can see that we're booting from the Ubuntu from the get-go. But we need to go down here because this is where our operating system is. So that's what we need to move up here. So what we're going to do is highlight the first one, hit enter, then we're going to go down, and we can select this guy. Alright, so that's selected. So we're going to go ahead and disable these other ones. <clears throat> so we definitely don't have no issues booting from the USB thumb drive. So now that you have that, we're going to save, so hit enter, hit enter again to save, and if all works, we should be booting from the USB. Alright, so now it's starting up, and as you can see, we are booting from the uh, USB. So we can just hit enter and we can run this basically live or we can install it. So, Alright, so now you can see we are booting the KDE Neon from the USB thumb drive from the Atomic Pi. So, there we go so it should come up here all right so now you can see we had the desktop up and if you look right up here it'll say that we can install this onto the drive space that's built in on the uh, <clears throat> atomic pie so as you can see, we just do the step by step and it'll install it. So hopefully this kind of helps out how to boot a USB on the Atomic Pi. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to hit the like, share, and subscribe button. Stay tuned for another one.